Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back. These are the Rummy Bears. I'm Rummy Bear Lauren. I'm Rummy Bear Sarah. And continuing on part three of our Dark Souls playthrough. Today we're doing uh, a different drink than the 99 watermelons. I've switched to uh, 360 Cola, and it's just a cola flavored vodka. Um, we're sticking with the same drinking challenge from our previous Dark Souls playthroughs. So every time he dies, he has to take a shot. Right. So our death counter is up to one so far from the unfortunate incident we had in the last episode. I don't anticipate dying that much during this uh, this episode, but I'm going to go ahead and take a shot just to start off things with, and uh, I'll give Sarah a bit of a fair chance at me taking another shot if I get a little more tipsy. If I get a little more tipsy during this episode, so... That is weird. That is a weird flavor. Maybe if it was carbonated, it would taste better. But just let the cola, the you know the cola flavored like vodkas I've had just are are weird. It's kind of like a watered down flat cola taste. <laughs> right. With alcohol. <laughs> you just imagine flat Coca Cola and then. Without just, the sweetness. Yeah. Without <laughs> it being so sweet. Right. So last time we talked to Solaire and he gave us the White Soapstone, which is an online play item only. You can leave a summon sign and then be summoned to another world as a phantom. But if you uh, make yourself human and uh, unhollow yourself, you can see other characters, usually before boss battles or just sometimes around the world, you'll see them and then you can summon people back in. So that's the only advantage of uh, turning yourself human if you're not doing online play. So I might do that just to just to see if we can encounter anybody you know before a boss fight or something like that. Just love this scenery so much. Just got a couple dudes up here. I am going to Oh shit! Dang it! I completely. <laughs> Whoa! So I knew that dragon was gonna appear, but I didn't think that he was would completely kill me. I was like, what is going on right now? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so that dragon that like attacks you earlier kind of flies over and then breathes down on the bridge, but that's the only way to get across that area. So. That's death number two, and another shot for me. Sweet. Yeah, dang it. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, so... I don't have any more humanity, I'm just gonna have to kind of run through that area again. Here, I think we might as well uh, kind of do a little more exploring now that we're in a, not in a rush to go to the boss. There's a couple things over here I forgot to do last time. Kill him. Go up here. make the drinking challenge is whenever I smash something. <laughs> Shot. It'll make like a good one minute episode or something. A good, a good five minute episode. Because that, yeah, that's all it's going to be.
Did I check if this door was locked last time? I don't remember. Thanks. I don't think we did. Okay. So that door is locked until I get get a key. Notice the uh, guy on the left there just healed. So these guys can actually heal themselves like that. Just trying to get him. Should I uh, go after this Black Knight right now? Mm. Or should I wait till I'm a little more drunk? I say do it. Do it? Alright. Let's, uh, let's do it. Do it. <laughs> Just do it! I'm gonna lure him into this, this open area that I cleared out so I can have a little room to fight him. There he is. I was thinking like maybe he disappeared and went back already. <laughs> too, that would have been too easy. <laughs> I also remember, like, once I started to sort of get the hang through, or the hang, what's that word? The hang of playing, <laughs> just the hang of this playing the game. And then I managed to get to this area, then being able to fight these guys was kind of the second big hump I had to learning all this. And it took me forever to figure out how to beat this guy. Yet, so. Dang. Now he's dead. Let's see. Oh, yes. Okay. I think that's somewhat of a rare drop, the Black Knight Shield. So I can actually equip that now. Alright, so compared to the Heater Shield, it's uh, better f uh, physical. Better fire, lightning, and stability has worse magic defense, but it has the same amount of physical damage or physical. Um, only downside is it needs 16 strength to wield effectively, which I don't have. Oh shit! But I mean, it's it's one level away, so I think I have enough souls to. Mm -hmm. Yeah, see how slow that shield swing is. So if I just go level up right now, it should be fine. Actually, uh, do that later, and then next time I get to a bonfire, I'm gonna do the level up. That's two hand it for now. This is when I might take another shot. 
just have to get past that dragon on the bridge. to be an adventurer like yourself. <laughs> I used to be a hollow like yourself and then I took an arrow to the knee. Alright, just gotta get past these guys. Yeah, all the, there. Yeah. So I get all their souls that the dragon is killed. strength and dexterity, so if I put points into strength or dexterity, it should be should be about the same either way. I'm going to put two into strength, one into my health, and then one into my endurance so I can carry more. I was going to take a shot there, weren't you? A little bit. Alright, so... Going from here, we can now go across this bridge, and we're just under the bridge where that dragon was. If I had enough time, and uh, I'll probably do this off camera, but I'll get enough money to buy a bunch of arrows and then I'll buy a good bow. And then we're gonna come revisit this dragon later. I'm not gonna do it right now, but we'll come, we'll come revisit this dragon later and uh, show you guys something interesting there. but I still didn't want it to drop off the edge of the cliff. So, kind of sneak along this edge here. Kill the rats in here. getting poisoned. But I really don't want to get poisoned. Off the top of my head though, I can't remember if you get poisoned if it's immediate death. I know if you get cursed, you, it's definitely an immediate death. And I think if it's poison, then it's just uh, slowly drains your health. But I remember having the toughest time with those rats. Hello. 
completely missed. I'm no good at judging distance. Just for fun, that alluring skull I've picked up, I've not never used those items, so I'm not sure what it causes certain animals to do. So I'm not sure if the warthog will go directly toward the skull or or what. Well, let's find out. I'm kind of hoping that when I throw this skull that he's going to run into the fire. And then just kill himself. That's good. That's my method for always killing this thing. Is I'll just uh, have him run into the fire, and then I'll kill himself. But I've never tried to use like one of these to see what happens. Oh well, that was <laughs> oh, that was an epic failure. I don't want to like. Oh, uh, I think you just wasted it. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to accidentally throw it and then run off, like accidentally drop off the cliff. Oh, come on, he was, he was like right, right inside of it. Well, right, let's see. Dang it. Let's, let's try to throw another one and then get it a little closer. That was like right in the fire. Okay. So he's, yeah, oh, he's nice. in the fire attacking himself. But he has too much health for that. That's, this guy's annoying. But not to worry. I have another method of, of dealing with that guy anyway. Get me. Let me shake the booty around. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'd be screwed if he could get through there. No, I'm, I am gonna finish finish him off the rest by myself. Uh, the last time I had he died in the fire, his like special item was lost. Like, is it stuck, got stuck in the fire? <laughs> and it won't let me get it. That's a little upset. Like, it's not a. Wait. Where'd he go? What? <laughs> Maybe it's a special drop or something. Right? I was like, does he always drop it? I, I thought so. It's like a special um, warthog helmet that has, like, horns on it. Oh, uh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, well, the first, the first time I did the playthrough, he did drop it. So, I'm, I'm going to have to check on that and see if it is a constant drop or not, because that's a, a real nuisance if it's not. guys are easy, but if they gang up on you, they do enough damage to take you down. Uh, individually, just pick them off. Oh, I'm kind of carrying him around on my arm. <laughs> <laughs> like 
dragging that on there. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm down. No. A mystery key. Yeah. Which I forget what that unlocks. I don't know if it'll tell me what it unlocks. Basic prison cell key. <laughs> purpose of the key is unknown. It's a mystery, as it were. <laughs> a couple more of these grunts to fight. I thought there was another item around here somewhere. I don't think it's a good item. Eh, it's large soul. It's decent. battle, but just leading to an area above where we came into that that portion. And if I'm good enough and not tipsy enough yet, we'll get the backstab on this night. I don't know why I tried to roll. That was that was kind of stupid. Half health, and I'm just gonna grab that in case he does kill me. Socket. Kind of surprised he didn't drop anything though. Not worth dying for today. That's that's for damn sure. Although I am getting a little thirsty, so maybe I'll just take another shot anyways. You're getting lucky, Sarah, because I'm kind of thirsty anyway. So maybe Free I'll shot. just <laughs> yeah. Like, oh, maybe I'll just take a shot. Free shot. Oh no! Went in. Too early on the jump. For some reason, it's like my. It seems like my target locking is not working. Like if uh, one of the other guys gets closer to me. It's like, that guy's spirit just went through the other guy. <laughs> <laughs> that should have done something. Like, what? Oh, oh, damn it. Woo, Shatter. Well, I was thirsty anyways. I was, 
I thought I could go right through those guys, and then they blocked me off. So that's kind of stupid, but it is Dark Souls, so. <laughs> Alright, but at least we knocked down the ladder so we don't have to go around the long way this time. And we don't have to fight the Warthog again. Mm, that's good. Oh, I did pick up, I didn't check out that new shield to see how, what its stats were. Uh, no, just a normal night shield. So, night shield has better magic damage, but much worse fire, and a bit less lightning and stability anyway, so I'm going to stick with the black night shield. Uh, black night shield's a rare drop, so I would assume that it has better uh, stats overall. To uh, up to three deaths now. See if I can keep it under five for the next couple hours. Push himself off the cliff. One last thing I have to do. I think I'm just going to kind of make a run for it. <laughs> Gotta go back down here. Oh, goodness. So, yeah, it's like, eh, I'll kill the people that end up falling. Since I don't have to worry about them. But uh, I was trying to say, I think there's something wrong with how I'm walking on, because this guy's closer to me, but it won't let me, yeah, like, switch between the targets, which it should be doing. So, I don't know, something, it's, it's letting me switch between once in a while, but not on demand as I would want it to, where I can just switch back and forth constantly. So something's something's a little screwy with how my locking on is performing. But right now, I don't want the guy way the heck back there. I want these guys. annoying, I can get used to it, but it is going to be probably uh, much more problematic during uh, in boss fights or something like that. Souls. And I'm just going 
keep running through these guys. I know he's gonna lose interest eventually. Just me and him now, so I might as well fight him. Maybe I'll get a, a drop from him or something. Oh. Nope. Unlucky. But, I like that sound that I'm hearing. Another lovely bonfire. So you can either go out that way, we can go downstairs. I wanna rest my health back. Now that this area is blocked off for a while and there's no danger of me running out here, so I'm not going to worry about it. But, let's see what he has to say. It's Sigward! Hmm. Or Sigmire! Hmm. Never remember which is which. Hmm. Hmm. I do have a, an awesome oh. Dark Souls shirt of this guy. I was absorbed in thought. I am Ziegmeier of Katarina. Ziegmeier. Honestly, My mistake. Flat up against a wall. Or a gate, I should say. The thing just won't budge. No matter how long I wait. Ziegmeier. But I waited. <laughs> so here I sit. Oh, it's onion man. Quite a <laughs> onion man. Option, so <laughs> <laughs> Still closed. Still closed. Mmm. Still closed. Mm. Okay. Well, that's always well, that's all he's got for us right now. Let's go back the other way. Let's go find out this lovely sound. I kinda wish you could just take the torch off the wall and then carry it around so you don't have to actually find <laughs> That'd another. That'd be pretty cool. Right. Like you can collect torches in um, Skyrim. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> right? Like Dark Souls be more like Skyrim and then Skyrim be more like Dark Souls. Well, the blacksmith. you must be a new arrival. I'm Andre of Astora. Andre of Astora. If you require smithing, then speak to me. Alright, sweet. So now we can, uh, we'll have some items to sell. We can repair our stuff, reinforce the weapons, make them stronger. And we learned a new destiny. I'll be seeing you then. Be careful out there. Thanks, Andre. What a pal. Point. Beckon. Beckon's kind of a useless, uh... Let's switch that out with a raw. Cool. Heck yeah. Alright, well I'm going to call it for this episode. So I think we're up to uh, three deaths right now. Not too many shots. <laughs> Not too many. Not as much as I'd want. Right, I know. Maybe next time we'll uh, we'll try to get you more. But... We can see some interesting gameplay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's probably not too interesting as of yet, but, um, you know, we're getting there. We're getting into the juicy parts. Right. Once I get a little more, you know, variety. We're just getting started. Exactly. 
Uh, well, thanks everyone for watching. Uh, like if you liked the video, hit the subscribe button, and uh, make sure you take a shot whenever you do any of those items. You know, take a shot for hitting the like button. Take a shot for hitting the subscribe button. And then just take a shot for yourself. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And then one for yourself. All right. Appreciate you, everybody. See you on the next video. See you guys later. Thanks for watching. Where's the bow? Or the? Here we go. Do the wave one.